Oprah Winfrey is usually the hero, but now some are calling her a villain. Winfrey is holding a nationwide contest to give someone a talk show on her new network, but there are reports that the votes might have been rigged. Contestants post an audition video to Oprah's website, and viewers vote. This is Zach Anner. He pitched a travel show, and his audition video has many praising his humor and inspirational attitude. Because I have something called cerebral palsy, which I believe is the sexiest of the palsies. Anner had been the contest frontrunner, especially after, as ABC points out, he got an endorsement from singer John Mayer. I will write and record the theme song for your travel show. I was kind of like, thanks for the offer, man, because like, I, I would love to have a theme song by John Mayer, because I had one that I was going to sing myself that would drive all the viewers away. But then things changed, Fox News explains. When suddenly, within just 20 minutes, he got overtaken by hundreds of thousands of votes for a woman named Dr. Phyllis. There are reports that Phyllis's vote button was altered during the time she got those votes, which could have allowed for behind-the-scenes vote manipulation by an Oprah employee. So, was the vote rigged by Oprah's people? The Internet has gone ablaze with accusatory comments and headlines like, Oprah hates the handicapped? Fox News asked Oprah's company how the votes were tallied, but never got a response. Erlesk.com believes the employee possibility. We haven't seen any evidence so far to link Oprah to the hacked poll. It could very well have been a rogue Oprah employee with access to the code and mischief on their mind, though. But a writer for The Stir says this just sounds like a technical difficulty. Sounds more like a technical glitch to me, or some good viral PR by Dr. Phyllis. If I'm being honest, Dr. Phyllis would get my vote between the two. Entertainment Weekly reports that Oprah's company will investigate the possible hacking. Until then, all the publicity might have given Anner a boost anyway. As of Thursday, he was beating Dr. Phyllis by more than one million votes. What do you think? Do you believe the contest was rigged? I'm Lauren Zima for Newsy.com. Multiple sources, the real story.